Hi. How was your prayer time today? Okay. Here we go. This is the Bible reading for June 13th from the One Year Bible for Kids Challenge Edition. A long wait, Simeon had waited a long time to see Jesus, the promised Savior. Look what Simeon said when he finally saw Jesus. Luke 2 21 to 35. Jesus is presented in the temple. Eight days later, when the baby was circumcised, he was named Jesus, the name given him by the angel even before he was conceived. Then it was time for their purification offering, as required by the law of Moses after the birth of a child. So his parents took him to Jerusalem to present him to the Lord. The law of the Lord says, if a woman's first child is a boy, he must be dedicated to the Lord. 24 So they offered the sacrifice required in the law of the Lord either a pair of turtle doves or two young pigeons. B. The Prophecy of Simeon. At that time there was a man in Jerusalem named Simeon. He was righteous and devout and was eagerly waiting for the Messiah to come and rescue Israel. The Holy Spirit was upon him and had revealed to him that he would not die until he had seen the Lord's Messiah. That day the Spirit led him to the temple. So when Mary and Joseph came to present the baby Jesus to the Lord as the law required, Simeon was there. He took the child in his arms and praised God, saying, Sovereign Lord, now let your servant die in peace. As you have promised, I have seen your salvation, which you have prepared for all people. He is a light to reveal God to the nations, and he is the glory of your people Israel. Jesus' parents were amazed at what was being said about him. Then Simeon blessed them, and he said to Mary, the baby's mother, This child is destined to cause many in Israel to fall, but he will be a joy to many others. He has been sent as a sign from God, but many will oppose him. As a result, the deepest thoughts of many hearts will be revealed. And a sword will pierce your very soul. Simeon was very happy that God's promise to him was finally coming true. And he was overjoyed that God's Savior had come. He praised God that Jesus would save people from their sins. Isn't it wonderful that God kept his promise and sent a Savior? You can praise God for Jesus just as Simeon did. Psalm 118 21 I thank you for answering my prayer and giving me victory. And that's our Bible reading for today. Okay. Bye.